It is a disturbing case that has even seasoned investigators who check on crimes against children shaking their heads. It involves this man here, a 30 year old who is now charged with rape. This after investigators say they found video of that man sexually assaulting a little girl. NBC4 reporter Ted Hart is live at the courthouse with more on this disturbing story. Ted. Hey, and Darlene, one of the investigators said this is the kind of case that just makes the hair on the back of your neck stand up. The victim in this case is a child believed to be between the ages of five and nine years old, and investigators have not yet been able to identify her. They hope that by getting the picture of Jared Bernie out there a little more, that that might generate some new leads, and they are concerned that there may be other victims in this case. Back in July, investigators tried to serve a search warrant at Bernie's home on Town Street. They had evidence at the time that he had been uploading child pornography. Bernie barricaded himself in his home before eventually surrendering, but it, it was as a result of that search warrant and going through Bernie's electronic devices that investigators were able to find the video of Bernie himself sexually assaulting a child. Major Steve Tucker at the Franklin County Sheriff's Office says investigators are now reaching out to the public for help. There may very well be other victims we're still investigating, and there may be victims that he just simply didn't videotape. So we're really looking for anybody who may have, uh, whose child may have had contact with him, especially alone. We'd like to speak with them. And Bernie appeared in court this morning. He was ordered held on a half million dollar bond. He has a preliminary hearing set for one week from today. Local for you and live downtown, Ted Hart, NBC4. Such a disturbing story. Ted, thank you so much.